having fun? Are you guys, uh, yeah, okay, whatever. Um, oh, geez, I'll tell you a little bit about myself, I guess. I'm, uh, uh, this is my gig now, man. I'm a, I'm a stand-up comic, and uh, I had a lot of weird jobs before this. I used to, used to work at a petting zoo for a little while, but I had to quit that. I was, was getting tired of uh, my uh, people touching me. I was, I was, I was getting a little tired of people touching me. Anyways, listen, you guys, uh, I, I do hope, uh, yeah, well, I guess I kind of hope you're having fun. Um, there's a lot of great stuff coming up. There's a fashion show. There's all kinds of wacky stuff. Uh, if you do see your host tonight, uh, Vito Brevis, he's a kind of a freaky cat, so try to keep a little bit of distance because he's a little odd. Anyways, I'll be back in a bit. Have a good time, all right? You're not invited. I don't mean here with me, to sit down, to open your mouth, whatever. I mean the party, the place, the event. You're missing something. You're incomplete. Who the hell are you? You don't have a pin. No dome, no nothing. That's the only rule around here. You're a party crasher. I should call Tuba. He's our bouncer. He gets rid of people like you. Hey, lighten up. Hmm, I don't know. I need more. You don't know who you are. You're lost. And I have to decide if I should save your sorry ass. <laughs> Pop quiz. What's your favorite color? <laughs> Whoa, too bubbly for me. Can you take it somewhere else, please? I'm going to give you some advice. There's a Wendigo spirit in the room tonight. A ravenous, wandering soul that will freeze your heart, tear it from your chest, and suck on it like a freezy. <laughs> but hey, your luck has held so far. This mode ain't big enough for the both of us. Blind, deaf, and domed. Do him. Go ahead. Oh wait, do him. I'm very good at integral and differential calculus. I know the scientific names of beings at animalculus. In short, in matters vegetable, animal, and mineral, I am the very model of a modern major general.
Modus operandi. Corpus sodelecti. I eulogize with euphemisms, euphonious, and euphoric. If you had seen me do half the things that I've done, <laughs> you'd only know the half of it. The immersion, it's helical, it's regressive. The DMT is reintegrating with the pyroglutamate to create a kind of elastic envelope that is causing me to blur and tatter around the edges. It's like the shadow of lightning on mica. It's like... Are you trying to get my attention? A stranger approaches me, a wandering soul, uncertain, unfocused but attractive. As always, when I first see someone new, I wonder, will I be their lover? They're watching me record my diary. Are they imagining me naked? Do you want to sit? So sit. There's something I want you to read. Tell me what you think. It's a lyric for a song I'm writing. I'm still working on it. Okay, that's enough. So what you think? This is a test. Good, give it to me, monkey. Are you joking? That was crap. Absolute, over-the-top garbage. Is that how you figure you're going to get into my pants by gushing over some stupid, crappy lyrics? I was going to give you something good to read, but I don't know now. Jeez. Daddy's little boy. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I'll give you one more chance. It's a little bit morbid, but I don't know. I kind of like it. Imagine it's set to a kind of heavy metal ballad, you know? So what? Nice lyric? Huh. I don't think so. That happens to be the Buddha and it's about 1500 years old. Though I suppose it would make a pretty good lyric as they go. Yeah, well maybe. But let's talk about you. What turns your crank? Okay, I'll narrow it down. Who's been cranking you tonight? That Riel is half mad, I think. Be very careful with him. I can give you some insight into him if you'd like. You'd better not tell Riel I've shown you this. Well, isn't this boring? Come on, let's dance. No? How about something hot and quiet? Wanna take a sauna? Hey, I can take a hint. You've been a lovely diversion, but I think it's time to explore a bit. Maybe see you again later. <laughs>